So it is October 19th. I had to check. And um, I'm down a pound today, so I feel good, especially because last weekend was not, not super great. And that was mainly because I had a rehearsal dinner and a wedding and The Walking Dead came back on, so we had a little bit of a party for that. So there was just a little bit of imbibing that probably didn't help anything, but the rest of the week went splendidly. I have actually not had, I'm on my hashtag no wine kick for, I guess today's the fifth day. Yay. Uh, and I and I do think that I lost the pound because of that. I mean, I feel great overall. I think that uh, the calories were still logged. So in my opinion, there's not necessarily anything wrong with having the wine. Obviously, you know, maybe choose red instead of white. I think wine is a better solution than anything else. I think beer is probably your least um, good option if you're going to drink. But there are a lot of light beers that are, you know, are 90 calories or whatever. So I am not a big fan of saying that you can't have anything. I, I let my ha myself have a bite of this or a bite of that. I went out for a really nice dinner with some friends this week. And I had, you know, a bite of each of the desserts that came to the table, and I still lost a pound this week. Would I have lost two pounds if I didn't? Maybe. Probably not. I, I, I logged those calories just like I logged everything else. My levels this week are looking outstanding. I, uh, again, I've still got to work on getting that spinach and the lentils in, which I think are going to help with my folate and iron levels. Other than that, it's really been, everything is going really well. Everything is um, ticking right along. I'm at 212.8, so I'm just a pound shy of my lowest weight in, as far as I can remember, uh, at least 15, maybe maybe a little longer than that, years. Uh, I know I topped over 200 in college, so I know I never dropped below that um, in that last you know 20 or so years. So. I would say that um, overall, I'm in a right, really great position. I'm in jeans that I haven't been able to fit in for a while. My Jag jeans fit nice. They're still a size 16, but they are um, they're fitting nice. They don't have as much stretch as other jeans, so that's always nice. The workouts are going well. Knees have been hurting. Um, I have uh, I have a lot of knee problems, um, arthritic problems, mainly because of having the weight for so long and still being very active. And you tend to stay. Relatively active, I do do a, a good bit of hiking and I do kickboxing and things like that. But again, everything seems to be good. Uh, my advice, I guess, for this week would be in, on the drinking front is that you know still log what you can, but read up on what drinking really does for your body. Alcohol is converted immediately into fat. Your body can't do anything else with it. It is not um, like a sugar that can be converted into energy. It is really really empty calories. And if you're going to um, have those calories, if the wine makes you feel good, you know, have that glass of wine, but just have one. And that's, that, I'm actually talking to myself. I'm going to watch this video afterwards so I can continue to hear myself tell myself that. So it is, it is one of those things that it, um, hands down, my, my goals are um, well within reach. Like I said, when I started, my goal of hitting the 150 by August of 2013 what required me to lose about a pound and well, 1.6 pounds roughly a week. I've had a couple of weeks where I lost a lot. Losing a pound in a week is not really a, a problem. My next um, goal, mini goal, is to break 210 by the end of October, and I've got three pounds to go. So I've got... Um, next week to weigh in and technically I, I am that is going to be my goal I am shooting to have a little bit better week this next week losing those three pounds will put me dropping below the 210 into um, closer to the wonder years which really I have not seen a one on the front of that for quite some time so that'll be a really great thing to see I guess one of the things I did decide I have started to think maybe I do not want a tattoo for my um, entering the wonder years, but I may instead get a Fitbit, um, you know, the chip or maybe the Nike armband. I, I think the Fitbit is probably something more along my lines. And I um, will see though. I haven't wanted to put the money out for it. I have some friends who really like it and I also have some sleeping problems that I think the Fitbit could probably help with identifying. We'll see.
I, I have um, I have about a month to go before I break that, and um, that'll be great. So I'll check back in, and everybody, my postings and Spark people and stuff will be down here, and I'll put any other tips that I think of this week down there. So thanks for watching.